And, and this summer, I went back to New York to visit with a really unusual kind of artist. City, the art capital of America. This is where you'll find the one and only Morris Katz, working furiously to maintain his reputation as the fastest artist in the world. He's also the only artist in the world who paints with toilet paper. Morris keeps track of his paintings like McDonald's keeps track of their hamburgers. More than 82,000 painted and sold so far. I decided to see for myself how the king of the volume art business works his magic. And so, off to the village for a visit with the man who discovered a gold mine in his bathroom. <laughs> you That's right, you do paper. work uh, with toilet tissue a lot, yeah. don't you? Yeah, uh, come on, I'm the world's uh, most experienced exponent of this unique tool. Well, well, the price you know? of that paper's going up, too, isn't it? Well, in my case, I'm blessed because I use hot toilet paper. I steal it from the hotels. You steal it from hotels? No. <laughs> I wipe them out in a few sheets. <laughs> sure. Here's Nebraska, the mountaintops of Nebraska. Okay. So the mountain, the, wait a minute, the mountaintops of Nebraska? Yeah, I mean, the, the lower bottoms of the top. That's going to be a surprise to the people back in Nebraska. <laughs> All right, well, <laughs> now let me show you how quickly trees, leafless and trees, could be down here. This is called cautiously applied and sophisticatedly expressed. I get signals from the top. <laughs> you know, here, the whole thing, look at this. They call custom cranes now. This is called custom overhead cranes because they're putting the thing put over the head. You know, it's like a piece of ice. It's a Polish piece of ice. Finally, a plant from uh, 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 Nebraska. All right. To the, to the suggestion of... I have the number on this one. I'm going to give you the number. It's this 80, is. 000? No, no, no. This is 82,928. This painting here, that, and 28, this is a special numbered painting. Matter of fact, I'm going to autograph it on the back with a number. This is masterpiece quality, here. Well, how, how long would it have taken you to do the Sistine Chapel if you were? Well, if I had the roller, I could do quicker. About half a day. <laughs> well, no, it's all I give myself two days. What's the difference? <laughs> because I tell you why. I tell the, you why, hey, The ecstasy with no agony. <laughs> well, how much do you sell these for when you go out? Well, uh, it depends how strong my customers are in the pockets, I mean, not yeah. the muscle. How much would you charge a tall blonde guy from the cornfields of Nebraska who's yeah, here in New York, in the sophisticated city of New York? I probably, what, $1,000? I wouldn't know any different. From Nebraska, I tell you what, from Nebraska, I am going to sell to you right now $8 for the whole $8. painting. Eight dollars <laughs> Well, if this guy could sell me a painting of Nebraska, speak of painting furiously, Morris schleps his inventory and his act north to art shows in the Catskills, where he sells them all. But not always as fast as he paints them. Well, as I rule in my studio, this would sell $350. Sixty dollars, I'm asking, an opening bid, frame is included, this original painting. Terrific. How much? You have a bit of sixty? Oh, a finger in the back, thank you, sir. All right, we got sixty already, I'm looking for a higher bid. Seventy, that's it. Eighty from the back. Don't well, wait so long, you almost lost on this one. Eighty once. Eighty dollars going twice. Last call. Sold eighty dollars. Come on, give a nice round of applause. All the way, a newcomer came in, some fresh energy. Come up, jump from the back. Folks, cheer him up to the cashier. The paintings of the world's fastest painter move fast. Is this a U.S. check? U.S. U.S. currency. That's what I'm interested. Only U.S. currency. I went back to his studio to see just how fast he really is. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Get set? Yeah. Go. Okay, here it is. It's almost finished now. <laughs> The whole gold, the gold rounds, I'm wiped out. Here's a stone on the bottom. <laughs> it's a rolling stone. Here's a seagull flying in the air. Good. Jonathan, this is Livingstone, right. and this is a pigeon. Seagull. Pigeon, seagull. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds left, and it's not filling. Give him some mouths. One is smoking a cigar <laughs> in the air there, in a fireproof, fireproof sky. This is great. Here comes the seagulls now. A few seconds now. Yeah, the 15 seconds left. 15 seconds left. Here it is. The signature signing it now. Where's my it. plane? Because the plane is done for the head. Presenting. Two minutes. The classic. Thank you.
you. Thank you so much. I had a, I have my good years and bad years. You know, I got ups and downs. I tell you. So the good year, I used uh, I used around uh, almost uh, eight and a half thousand rolls of toilet paper a year. Not sheets. I'm talking rolls. I can outpaint any painter that ever lived before or after me.